Uh, I'm Jim Logan with the Memphis Fire Department and with the Memphis Shelby uh, County MMRS, which is the Metropolitan Medical Response System uh, Program Manager. Uh, what we did here today was uh, prepare our first responders for uh, better emergency preparedness. Um, we did a procedural cadaver lab that uh, really uh, perfected some of our uh, advanced uh, life support skills. Uh, in conjunction with that, we did a um, mass casualty uh, simulation, uh, which involved, a, uh, the scenario involved a improvised explosive device. Um, and I guess you've seen a lot of that on, on your other footage. Uh, it was very impressive. Uh, students got a lot out of it. And uh, Memphis Shelby County is certainly more prepared for, for uh, events of this type. Okay. How did, uh, how did the Mary do today? Or were we a valuable part of, the, part of this experience? I, I think valuable is probably the wrong word. Uh, to use uh, you guys you guys were awesome uh, we, we really appreciate your help and hosting and sponsoring this course and uh, and of course you know we'll be back to do this uh, and, uh, you know, I think uh, that you'll get that from further interviews from the participants uh, and that's where you're going to get your your uh, your best comments I believe uh, as a facilitator I saw um, a lot of lights come on a lot of uh, awakening down in the lab of uh, this is why we do this and this is how this actually happens and uh, this is what we do for our patients. Um, in this scenario, it was really uh, good to see uh, the participants uh, come together as teams and work efficiently uh, and quickly to get the, the patients treated appropriately and out to the transport uh, sector. Uh, all in all, it was a great experience. Okay. And one last question. Obviously, it's a, it's a, it's better to have them, be, you know, being trained in a in a uh, si simulated disaster than you know learning for the first time. In a, in a real thing, how do they do? How are you? How do, how do you think your teams did overall? I'm very happy with the responses. I'm very. Uh, you're, you're quite right. There's something. There's good takeaways from both experiences. But you know, actual events, you, you learn lessons, uh, and, and you make mistakes. Here's where we make. We, we can freely make mistakes and have an educational opportunity on top of that. Uh, so what we were able to do, what we're not able to do in an actual uh, uh, situation like this or a mass casualty incident like a Katrina or like a 9-11, um, you don't have time for that educational piece when you're actually, um, you know, are involved in it here. You can, you can kind of slow down and stop and say, here's what you need to think about. Here's what you may want to do. Consider this. So those are the, those are the good takeaways from an experience like this. Okay. Thank you very much.